Hi, in this video I will show you how to farm gold by doing Sunset Cloister runs in Dragon Nest C. In addition I will give some important notes to get more gold in the process so be sure to watch the whole video. To enter Sunset Cloister, you need a Sunset Cloister map. You can get a Sunset Cloister map by exchanging 10 Sunset Cloister map fragments, tradable or untradable, from the NPC Priestess of Darkness Canal in Sunset Training Ground located at Red Lotus Palace Main Streets. Important note, there are two types of Sunset Cloister map fragments, tradable and untradable. So where to get Sunset Cloister map fragments? You can get Sunset Cloister map fragments from Labyrinth Invaders and Tomb Invaders. Usually, Sunset Cloister map fragment, untradable, is more likely to drop than the tradable one. And you can also obtain Sunset Cloister map fragment, untradable, from Lost Hound event while doing Sunset Cloister runs. The next source of the Sunset Cloister map is the Ladder Point Shop. To buy Sunset Cloister map, you need to get Ladder Points. You can obtain ladder points by doing 1 vs 1 ladder matches every week. You can play ladder match weekdays from 6 pm to 12 am and weekends from 12 pm, noon, to 4 pm and 6 pm to 12 am, and every preseason, you can enter every day at any time. And if you already have ladder points, you can buy 35 Sunset Cloister maps every week. How to enter Sunset Cloister To enter Sunset Cloister, you will need to go to the Red Lotus Palace and go to the Sunset Training Ground. To get there fast, press O, then type RL and join the party, and you will be teleported in Red Lotus Palace fast in this process. When entering the Sunset Cloister, for the difficulty, you can choose from Normal, Master, and Abyss. For new players with low gear, I recommend doing Normal Runs, and as for the geared players, you can choose the Abyss difficulty. Where is the gold? You will get 2000 gold every time you encounter Gold Goblin events while doing Sunset Cloister runs. There is also a low chance of dropping Sealed Blood Moon Dragon Jade to sell for 20,000 plus gold in the Trading House. Sadly I didn't get any sealed Blood Moon Dragon Jade in my runs. I will show you the drop chance of Blood Moon Jade just for guide and reference. So for the conclusion, in my 88 runs in Sunset Cloister, I earned 24,000 gold. Or more if I got sealed Blood Moon Dragon Jade. Did you enjoy the video? If you do, please do hit that like button. That's all for the guide. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.